<laughs> How's it going, people? You're all good. This is this is your man, the Baltic Gladiator. Do you know why they call me the Baltic Gladiator? I don't even know, but I slash up fools. Yeah. <laughs> but anyways, um, that was really quite cheesy and horrible, but that's okay because now you've seen a different side to me, not the the mean, tough guy. I don't even know if you see that. Do you know what I'm saying? It's fight week for UFC Fight Night Till versus Brunson. A mad, mad London card. So I just thought I'd just show you what goes on, what I do, what I don't do, what I might do. Or maybe not any of that, just literally what I do, but I'm in my swim shorts right now. Oh, also, also, let's wait till the lighting gets good. Lighting gets good. Oh, you can't see anything. Oh, but oh, when the lighting came in, you see that man's on point with his weight. I woke up, I was about 2.14. This is Saturday before the Saturday of the fight and it's only nine pounds. I mean, pff, I mean, literally I could go eat like 10 brownies today and it'll be all right. I don't know, we'll see what happens later. I mean, I might, but I might not. But listen, bro, if you can make weight and you can perform, then go eat some brownies, you know what I'm saying? Um, but uh, yeah, uh, very bad color coding. Uh, actually, I don't know if blue goes with yellow, but. Anyways, bad hair day, that's why the hat is in. Sancti Pue, mad tings. I, I like I like this stuff. You should like this stuff too. Um, but yeah, I've got a swimming workout. I had a really hard week this week, um, this past week. This was last hard week. That's a bit of like a chill, get your mind ready, uh, get yourself amped up and ready to freaking go. Um, and uh, yeah, I thought we would uh, might as well look at the old uh, vision board of course see what happens you lot are seeing it here first one week left till fight night las vegas modestas picasso's your boy wins by vicious ko performance bonus we're winning that 78 g's all together 12 and 4 new record signing a new deal with the ufc 2 and 2 record this is mystic mac operating this is now being recorded obviously the week before we head out to Vegas. So, speak it into existence, people. I'm telling you, law of attraction, just get on it. Fight through all the bad times to get on to the better times. So yeah, I'll just be sort of recording all the all the good parts of the week. There's not gonna be a lot of like amazing parts because it's just eating like lettuce. Well, I mean, apart from today, you know, no. <laughs> um, but yeah, and just like training. And obviously I'll show you a bit of Vegas, so. Yes, people, loving life, loving the opportunity to go out and perform. Let's get it. I'm not doing this thing. I'm doing this thing. Yeah. The boss in the yeah. building. Where are we going to today, sir? Swim. We're going to swim, guys. We're getting out with the dolphin. I this... put him in Olympic mood. Oh. Get ready. Yeah, mate, the Tokyo Olympics have just been just been finished or they've just been over so there's no, been a lot of Paralympics still on oh, well there's still Paralympics technically obviously yeah we've got him telling me uh, all the stuff extra details um, yeah so we're about to get this done I hate it but I love it at the same time we're on that good energy because we've got Vegas next week don't we sir yeah don't and we... today you're gonna get dead and simple <laughs> <laughs> Oh, great. Anyways, we'll see you over at the pool, peeps. Secret location. You don't even know where it is. I don't even know where it is. We're we'll about to get it on. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, yes. It's good to have mates who've got pools so you can use them and swim and like work out and get ripped, mate. Just like that. <laughs> <laughs> It couldn't really focus too much, obviously, but he's got a lot more muscle than me, uh, clearly. But that's where I get the good genetics from, you know what I'm saying? But anyway, swimming workout, time to get it done, people. Time to get it done. Yes, had to show the abs because I'm weight cutting, of course. Yes, mate, swimming workout done. As you can tell, a very, very damp lad. Got dad in the pool, practicing his uh, roundhouse kicks, and his punches for all the sh many street fights that we'll be getting into, or not. Um, but yeah, sorry I couldn't show much of the workout. Man's are working out here. Can't be recording stuff. Listen, when I get my own, you know, cameraman, he'll be recording all this stuff and then you see more of it. But 
essentially it is a hundred yeah a hundred hundred there's and back in this pool butterfly is slow look and he's going to show you the butterfly now look at him he's, he's, he's a dolphin he's a dolphin he's a dolphin uh, like i think he was raised by by mammals um that's why I'm gonna be a beast in that cage next week. Urgh. But anyways, yeah, so 100 laps, different things, different lamps using, obviously, the board as well. Um, just getting it, getting it kicking, mate. And uh, thank you very much to our friend for letting us use his uh, house, lovely. Um, now just rest up, chill, relax for the rest of the day, and who knows what you're doing next. He's getting his hair cut for sure though, because man is a shaggy haired lad. Take care, people. Yes, yes, peeps. How's it going? I've got that that fresh that fresh trim, so it's looking much more neat, much better, much more ready to go and freaking bump up in the room and look all naughty. <laughs> I couldn't think of any descriptive word, so naughty was the obvious first one that came into my head. Um, now I said, well, speaking of naughty, I said I was going to do something a little bit naughty today. I was thinking about getting some brownies but but unfortunately my weight although it's good could be better could be better i mean i want to be nice and light for when i go into fight with you know what i mean i don't want to be cutting too much weight i just want to be feeling fresh but i'm buzzed off of caffeine oh my gosh i've had like three cups today i'm rolling so what i'm gonna have for a little treat if i can find it oh it's in the fridge let's go to the fridge I'm going to take you with me to the fridge. Also, Crafted London. Uh, all right, the light's horrible here, so obviously I can't show it to you. And you've literally just looked at my chest for about 20 seconds. Or more than that, but anyways. Crafted London, next level chains. Get on it. I advise you. I'm not just advising you, I'm telling you. This isn't a plug for them. Well, it is a plug for them, but I generally enjoy it. Um, so we're going to go for one. Grenade, obviously, uh, where's it at? Informed sport. Come on, focus, mate. Focus, 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 focus. Informed sport. For all of you, uh, you Sada peeps out there, you Sada peeps. And another one, informed sport. So that's going to be two lovely chocolate bars that will go, which will sort of take place of the brownie section. You know, the ones that I wanted, I wanted, I wanted to be a little bit more, do you know what I mean? I just want some calories, they're so low, do you know what I mean? But I'm looking fresh. Is the lighting good? The lighting is good. The abs are good. Everything's good. But it's pretty boring from here on out. Like, you know, like, I don't even know what I'm going to be doing tomorrow. I might even take you for a walk with me and just chat to myself on a camera. <laughs> do you know what I mean? Because uh, I'm not really doing much. Um, but yeah. I'll catch you in the next vid. Fight week is popping, mate. Popping, popping. So full of energy. Let's get. What's up, peeps? So, it's a testament to taking risks and being a daredevil and living life on the edge and doing things crazy. Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to place a bet <laughs> on the Tyron Woodley and Jake Paul fight. Actually, I'm not placing a bet. I've already placed the bet. So, do you know what? Um, I'm not going to say anything. Uh, I'm just going to show you. I'm just going to show you. So, pretty much what I've done is, uh, well, if this thing decides to actually load up for me, <laughs> that would be great. Um, so, look, as you can see, uh, let me let me just switch around the camera. Because, you know, this is all highly technical, technical stuff around here. So... I have placed a bet on Tyron Woodley to win around six. 85 quid. I'll get two grand back if I win, <laughs> mate. Living life on the edge. You know, we're all taking gambles. We take gambles in life. Do you know what I mean? I'm taking a gamble. In, and this is just a testament to me taking loads of risk and just going all out. I can put all out there on my fight on... Uh, next saturday just literally just living life no regrets just freaking giving it my all so there you go place a little bit if i win i get two grand if not okay i lose 85 quid but i'm about to make a load of freaking money from my fight so it don't even matter anyways 
but hey why not become a little bit richer eh so yeah daredevil daredevil yeah <laughs> mate i'm a straw head haystack horse eating horse eating hay hair guy right now in the morning i don't even have a watch but i think it's like eight five ish stayed up to watch a bit of the ufc always repping time to go check that weight sunday morning week out mm -mm -mm -mm. right so here we go official wait time let's put this here so that we can see everything Easy work, easy work. We make him wait. No problems. <laughs> Let's get it. Maybe, do you know what? I'm feeling there might be a couple brownies today. So there wasn't any yesterday because the weight was high, but now the weight is low. Ooh, I'm feeling it, I'm feeling it. Get that extra, you know, carbs, yeah. Glycogen, yeah, yeah. Oi, oi, it's a new day back in the same room that you've been seeing for pretty much the backdrop of most of this uh, video. But anyways, it's not gonna keep you too long because obviously I don't wanna bore the fuck out of you. But anyways, so today we're getting our COVID tests, getting ready to leave to Vegas tomorrow. Um, gold chaining, gold chaining, crafted London. So if, I mean, listen, if you wanna look gangster, gangster like me, then get down to craft actually. Don't do it because you wanna look gangster like me. Do it because you want to be a classy, good-looking, um, aesthetic, um, crowd-pleasing. Anyways, whatever. That's what I want to do. But you do whatever you want to do. All right. So yeah, going to get our COVID tests. Um, get ready. Get the PCR. Boom. Get ourselves cleared. Boom, boom, boom. Get the results back same day. And then, uh, and then yeah, off to Vegas tomorrow. So, and then just one training session, and we're just chilling, and we're staying up all night. <laughs> Might record some of that. Might not, but I tell you what, bit annoyed because Tyron Woodley, well, he lost by split decision to Jake Paul, which sucks because that means I lost 85 quid. But then again, I could have won 2200. So, do you know what I mean? It was a gamble worth taking. It was a gamble worth taking. But I tell you what, the losing stops there because we're going out to Vegas next Saturday. We are going to prove ourselves. Baltic Gladiator is going to put on an absolutely fine performance. $50,000. We're going to go and win this thing. I'm telling you here first. Let's get it. Here we go. Off to the COVID tests. May record, may not. Probably will. Probably say what's up. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> You right, chauffeur? Yes, I am. Chauffeur and coach, double trouble. Where are we going? <laughs> COVID to test if we've yeah. got or not. Of we're course not, we don't. We're not going to get COVID, yeah. We're, we're going to test for COVID. Yeah. yeah. So that we can go to Vegas and put on an absolute killing. Yes, sir. All right, you have fun. All right, all right, all right. So, I mean, this is pretty boring. We're just in the car going off to the place. So I see you lot in a bit. Dad says it's uh, it's very warm outside, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and this is London, people. You don't look good, change. So, Dad's just gone for his test. Soon it will be mine. And oh my lord, in this light, I look well tanned, bruv. <laughs> you can't even hear me, probably, but gotta keep on. Safety protocols, you know what I mean? Good times, good times. So, COVID tests have been completed. <laughs> yeah! We had to do it all ourselves and dad decided to get a little bit too eager with the swab. Ain't that right dad? Yeah, put right into my astronaut. 
<laughs> he was pretty much poking the uh, poking the swab right through his eyeballs. Probably would have come out of his ear at some point. <laughs> but he obviously wanted to make extra sure that uh, we did the test properly. So that's just a sign of a guy who pays close attention to details. <laughs> As always. As always. Love it, love it. Now it's time to get a little workout in. And then, yeah, tomorrow we go in Vegas.